CRL East 2020 champions, Nova Esports. Why did an unstoppable team like Ponos lose in the CRL East Falls final match? It's because they were matched with Nova Esports, the team with victory running through their veins. Nova climbed from being the special season's bottom team all the way up to the fall finals champions under the leadership of LCO. This is their fifth regional title in six years. Now, they're ready to compete for their second world championship. AUK, the hero that led Nova to win three championships in 2018, came back to the team this fall. The perfect chemistry he built with LCOP worked wonders like before. On top of that, AUK has shown outstanding potential in solo games, making him one of the most well-rounded players in all of CRL East. D-King, a solo master from the former CRL China region, joined Nova this fall. He didn't play as much as before, but still managed one of his signature sweeps in King of the Hill. Don't forget that in the 2018 CRL China fall season, he put on a miraculous showing of three clean sweeps in three consecutive matches. CRS. Apart from AUK and DK, Nova also signed CRS, the key to their franchise reboot. On the surface, he may look mild-mannered, but he becomes a beast on the battlefield. CRS has now climbed to Nova's number two man, Rain. As Nova's icy vein closer, Rain has been putting in the work. This fall season, he did his utmost best every time he came onto the stage, as proven by how he defeated KK in King of the Hill at the grand final. Little Chen, a Clash Royale genius from China. This fall, he had a low attendance percentage and his solo win rate dropped to 30%. But Little Chen still has that big heart. In the finals deciding set against Fav Gaming, he clean swept Expo Master and took the team to grand finals. Elsiop. After a tough special season, Elsiop bounced back in the fall with a head to head record of 17 wins and 5 losses. This astounding 77% win rate in King of the Hill placed him above Mugi on the charts. He also racked up a 2v2 win rate of 7 wins and 1 loss with AUK. Numbers aside, Elsiop's been phenomenal in battles since day one. At the Grand Finals especially, he took wins over the Double R duo, Mugi and KK in 2v2, King of the Hill, and 1v1 respectively. No one deserves to be the king of CRL East more than Elsiop. Considering he's the holder of six championship titles and three FMVPs, he's undoubtedly the strongest candidate for the CRL's GOAT glory. Nova Esports, an all-star team with a shot at becoming our first ever two-time world champions. Compared to the seven other teams, Nova has an illustrious history of being champions. They didn't just happen to claim the glory all six times. The championship mentality within them will inspire them to claim another world championship title. At the 2018 CRL Tokyo World Finals, they were crowned champions. At the 2019 Los Angeles World Finals, they lost in the very first round. Nova, the only team that has competed in three consecutive years at the final stage, will only focus on retaking the glory. On December 5th and 6th, will Nova Esports reach the top once again? Don't miss out.